morning guys welcome back to another day of vlogmas it is currently at 10 30. i've had a little bit of a slower start to the day and then i filmed a bunch of branded content for instagram and now i'm here i'm gonna start doing my makeup guys like look at him i have actually really loved the rare beauty foundation i know she got um, a lot of praise for the line because it's actually really good from everything that I've tried. Okay, so I have therapy at noon today, then I have a call at 2, and then we have fun, festive plans. Giving you guys a little update on how Vlogmas is going to work because I know a lot of you guys follow me on Instagram and you guys see everything happening. So the vlogs are going to be delayed a few days. I'm going to the lake house next weekend with my family and we have like legit no Wi-Fi there, but I didn't want to miss a day to upload. So... Just by the way it's worked with sponsors, pre-filmed vlogs, things like that. We are going to be ahead a few days for the next like week or so. Then when I get back from the lake, it will be like true day of uploads because I'm just going to do one big lake vlog because we're going to be ahead so much. This is confusing, but just know we're a little bit ahead. You guys should be getting videos every single day. Are you ever just in a period of time where like nothing sounds good for breakfast, but you're so hungry? Because that's where I'm at right now. Yeah. I decided that today I'm going to steer Dominique into a productive, productive um, headspace. I, first off, not only have I already ruined my really expensive leather pants, but I got powder all over them. I just give up. No, I think they, they look fine. I think they just need to be stretched out. You know how that's gonna, I don't know how that one's gonna happen. Go, go. Okay, Dom, I don't see your laptop. Yeah, I should have brought that. I'm now ready for the day. And I'm blonde. It's so crazy. I actually like the blunt cut, I think. I'm kind of into it. Yeah, it looks good. Wait, you have... Oh yeah, no, it's all over me. This is why I'm not a beauty guru. Spends way too much time getting ready. <laughs> I take approximately seven minutes to get ready every day, so... I know, you literally don't take a lot. Dom is trying to make a diss track, and it's just like not going well for her. Anyways, I've changed. I'm wearing this bag today. This turtleneck is Kindle and Kylie Paxson. I bought it in high school, and I've had it that long. I wore it. Wow. I've worn it every single year since. It's vintage. It's vintage, Kindle and Kylie. <laughs> um, I have this black coat that is J. Crew. These black pants are Revolve, and then I'm wearing Converse. I will show you guys. I need to clean this mirror. It's really bothering me. It's weird wearing all black when I'm a chocolate brown sort of girl now. Yeah. But like, here we are, you know. Oh my gosh. Do you have a um a notepad out? Do you Doing... see Harry Styles as my screensaver? Coco just wants to listen to The Cure and Phoebe Bridgers and not move a muscle today, right, Coco? No, because you have to do things. Well, actually, we're we're at around three. 2.30 p.m. we're off for the day, so it will be good for you. Praise God. But until then, while I'm gone at therapy, you have to-dos. I do? Yeah, you do. Get your notepad out. Nope. I'm going to give you a light load today. For so you, that means a heavy one, so. You are going to have to have eight people on your list for the uncomfortable for potential guests. This should be easy. You should have a running list as is. I'm realizing I probably sound mean, but if you guys haven't watched the vlogs before, this is like what Dom asked me to do for her. So it's like not mean. And we both just had attitudes with each other as like a joke that day. Um, yeah. So I promise it's like not actually mean. You really should. That's really an important part of having a really podcast. I can't believe you're yelling. You so much <sighs> violence today. You know what was so cute? We were in a call with your media this week and they were like, Kinsey's been with the fam since day one. Dom's also been a part of the fam. And then she launched her own podcast. Isn't that so cute? It is true. It is true. true. Also, for those of you guys who don't know, because I feel like we should explain our friendship in a second. Okay, let, next thing. Three emails. You have to prove that you've done podcast outreach. And three is nothing. I'll do like 20 in a day. It's the same email template, and then you just write why you want to have them on. Do you have an email template for this? Kind of, yeah. Okay. Um... And then content calendar for the remainder of December. 
content calendar? Like something. Like you need to be like, I'm gonna post this, I'm gonna post graphics on Monday, I'm gonna post vlogs on Wednesday, I'm gonna post something. Like you need to have some sort of plan where it's intact because you cannot get anything done if you don't have a plan. You can't just wake up at 11 and then just be like, well, we'll see. You have to start posting. You're right, Kathy. Giving a little backstory on our friendship because I feel like people get confused a lot. Dom and I were like best friends in college. So that's been like two years at this point, two and a half years. Yeah. And Dom was just like my friend from college, wasn't really on socials, but was always in my vlogs and then on my podcast. We wouldn't have been really always in the vlogs because I used to like really keep friends off at the time, but Dom was like always the one that I would put because I trusted Dom the most, you know? Yeah. And then, yeah, she started recording podcasts with me and then you guys loved her on the podcast and it kind of just went from there. Dom's social media following came from this summer with a bunch of activism stuff. So we're not friends from social media. I feel like people think that all the time. We were actually best friends in college. Yeah. That's how Kenzie and I met. I knew that she had a huge following. <laughs> How do I get close to this girl to use her for all her resources? Exactly. And now I've made it into her house. Well, look at who we have here, Mr. Fitz. Mr. Handsome, handsome Mr. Fitz. Okay. Guys, I just can't get over my hair. This was a great decision. Okay, Dom. Well, look at these pups. Okay, Dom. So what are you, what are you gonna do while I'm gone? Uh, don't even don't even get me started on who's leaving who. Um, I'll be gone for the next hour and a half. Um, what is your to-do list? And you're gonna report back when I get there home, right? Yes. Are you excited? But I'm leaving therapy and I'm in the best mood. I had a really good session. I am doing so much better than I was doing even just a few weeks ago. And I'm just feeling good about life. But yeah, I'm on my way home. We're gonna see if Dom has actually done her work that I gave her. I'm home, Dom did not do her work, could not believe it. Um, I just got off a little Zoom call. I have 30 minutes until I have another call. So I'm gonna make some taco soup. Hopefully it is fast enough. There's something about cooking that just puts me in the best mood. I'm going to show you guys how to make this recipe. Again, I always post them on Instagram my reels after. So if you guys ever wanna go back, just follow my Instagram because that's where I keep all of the recipes. This looks really easy and it sounds so good on this cold winter day. Your work go, Dom. Really good. Mm -hmm. Not working, guys. My lens is. Oh my gosh, the glare. Ugh. I think it's actually better now. It's because I'm angelic. I have a call, so Dom's gonna take over Coco taco knocked duty. Knocked on the door to talk to. Um, Coco knocked on the door when you left. So I'm finally famous. All right, guys. I have a call right. Actually, now I need to figure out what the dial in is. Hopefully it's not on Zoom. I mean, I am ready, so. Isn't that the worst when you realize it's a Zoom call? It's not this time. off the call. Let's see if Dom burned our lunch. Wow. Oh, Dominique? Oh, no, guys. What'd you say? Oh, she's busy. <laughs> Stop. Cooks once. Doesn't even cook, just stands there to make sure it doesn't burn as it simmers. Um, you know, I really made sure to put my back into it. 
Oh my gosh, guys. She literally had to watch it as it simmered. I stirred it this whole time. You don't have to stir it the whole time. Oh. Oh my god, no. <laughs> you know what simmering means? No, but I got nervous. <laughs> I was like, I'm not gonna mess this up. This would be a great time to talk to you guys about our book club. So, a lot of people ask how you join the book club. It's really easy. You literally just read the book and you listen to the podcast episode. <gasps> join the Facebook group too because we talk about it in there, but basically... <laughs> I say this as I'm cooking and I'm telling you my book club podcast once a month for the last half of an episode I'll do like first half solo first half of a guest on for book club and we recap the book So I read with a different guest last year year last month We were with Lauren Elizabeth this month. We're reading with Dom and we're reading in holidays So get the book read and the episode will be up on Christmas Eve If you are one of my step siblings stop watching now. Okay guys. I just got a little gift in the mail not a gift in the mail <gasps> Oh my gosh, it's way cozier than I thought. I got my stepsisters, or one of them, her Christmas gift came in the mail from Aloe. Oh my gosh, it is so soft. She like runs marathons and stuff, and like we're very different in that way, in that regard, if you will. You know what, when I posted the other day that I was thinking about becoming a turkey chop person, like kill me now, most people replied like that they would have thought I already was one. And I didn't know whether to be honored or um, offended. So, anyways, this is what I got her for Christmas. I'm just constantly sharing the gifts because, you know, people need gift ideas. On my Like to Know profile, I have all my gift guides up, and I also have a video as well if you guys need more inspo. Then, for myself, I got a nice pair of gray sweatpants from Aloe because I actually don't have a nice pair that I really like. My Aritzia ones, I've worn too many times and are finally, like, too small, I think. But these... Oh wow, I love these. Like an early morning coffee run. Wow, yeah, I got a size small. And I got them for a really good deal, but if you guys need like a nice pair of gray sweatpants, I've always heard great things. <laughs> I've always heard great things about Alice sweatpants. Okay, I just changed again. I'm wearing my boots that I wear legit every single day. I screenshot a bunch of photos of me in outfits to make a thumbnail, and I was wearing these boots in all six of the photos. I was gonna be yeah. Did you put Windex on? No, I should though. It's just making me really sad. Well, don't be sad. Be glad. Thanks, my depression's cured. We're on our way to the Adolphus. They just opened. We're actually gonna be the first customers because they opened today at four, but it's called Miracle on Commerce. And basically their rooftop, they have this like outdoor igloo situation. I'm, yeah, it's gonna be fun. This is my going away present party. I'm kidding. Are Don't book your flight for Sunday, so we're Are fighting. we not allowed to joke? No, we're are not. Are we not allowed to spread a little Too soon, you know? Comedy Too soon. during Christmas. <laughs> We're at the Adolphus, my favorite hotel in Dallas. This is where we got tea. Yeah. Remember? <laughs> Guys, it is like actually insanely beautiful. So it's all outside, and then we have this whole cabana to ourselves. So, what a beautiful day. Some hand sanitizer. Do you think they have food here or just drinks? I'm sure they have. This is so cute. Hey, this is what we were talking about getting from my house the other day. Like, you know. Yeah. What's, ooh. Uh, wait. That'd be purr. I don't know where I'd put it, but I want one. All right, guys. I have my champagne and my mug. They just poured it. Oh my gosh, stop. It is so cute, guys. I'm literally so happy. So, Dom, I'm currently reading comments. Oh, I like those. I'm currently reading comments that say, I'll be so sad if Dom ever leaves. So are you going to tell them? Okay, guys, listen. I have to take care of some business really quick. But once business is taken care of, I'm back. 
I'll believe it when I see it. Kenzie, I'll literally be back. You'll literally be whipping your neck around because you'll be like, oh my gosh, you're already back. She thinks that she's gonna go to the lake house with my family next week. Am I not allowed to? No, you are, but I just don't see you being back in time. Why? Also, did you see people were commenting like details about Austin for you to say to your yes. bunch boys? <laughs> Because I was like, oh my god, wait, I'm so dead. She was like, your favorite place to eat is here. Yeah. I was like, wait, I, I love to, it. I also, like, Dom is so cozy. We love no, it. No, look, I literally have my, like, my jacket <laughs> under here. Guys, I'm just so happy. Like, this place is everything I've ever wanted. Every Christmas just makes me so happy. Wouldn't you? Do you think there's anyone who loves Christmas more than me? No, do you know anyone? No one. <laughs> um, dude, every time I go to the Dolphins, I'm like, I. What's so funny is I didn't want to get ready. Clearly, if you saw before, I was wearing the same thing I wore yesterday mm -hmm. and the day before. <laughs> um, but I'm just like, what if I meet my man here? I mean, it'd be hard. We're social distancing to these. We're How are we ever supposed to meet boys? We like guys. We literally will never meet boys because like I'm just social distance anytime I leave my house. Wait, guys, does anyone have brothers we could date? Like, imagine us as your. I'm sister unbelievably boss. picky. Okay, but imagine us as your sister in law. We want to like be with brothers. So. so we could be related if you set us up. A great story time. Perfect. Dom, why am I just not realizing this is the same coffee table that I have on my rooftop? Oh, well, yeah, it is. It's really similar. We got s'mores. Dom got a sprite. My eggnog should be here shortly. It's really cute. Look at how cute this is. It's a honey bear. Dom made fun of me so much earlier and was like, it's not a honey bear, it's a, it's a marshmallow or something. No. And the guy's like, oh, the honey bear. And I was like, <laughs> you don't say. You really, you really don't say, you don't say. Taste test time, guys. I don't, I know I've had eggnog before, but I don't remember it. This is what we have here right now. Don does not care. Your eggnog? It looks so, Kenzie, you know eggnog's my favorite very good. Christmas drink? Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh. It is so cute. Thank you. Oh my gosh, it's so much prettier in person. You can't even really see anything. Ah, oh, love. Okay, I'm not that hungry, so I made myself a cheese board of the leftovers I had from said cheese board. Fitz actually just successfully played fetch for the first time. I cannot believe you are so genius. Yes, you are. I'm in my Christmas pajamas, so we're matching. Okay guys, I'm about to get in bed for the night and edit. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. It is freezing and I just want to edit and go watch some Vlogmas, but I love you guys so much. Hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.